close. But you know what? Your bathroom is anywhere. We're at the one kilometer mark. Seven more to go. We just passed the half kilometer and my heart was like pumping really fast and it's still going really quick. We're so high up now that there's snow. It's so misty. It's a bit hard walking up hill because these shoes are like sliding. I'm pretty sure I ride eight kilometers round trip. We just hit the two kilometer mark. So we're halfway up the hill, a quarter way done our trip, I think. It seems to be, as you can hear, hailing or snowing or raining. But I know it ain't snowing because out there is nice and warm. I think it's because the warm temperature is melting out all the snow from the leaves and it's making it snow here. When you're down there, you're so close to the edge, it's scary. So I'm like <sighs> crawling upwards. <sighs> oh gosh. I should get, I know it's just get some spike shoes. <sighs> I like figured out how to get down. <sighs> I decided to turn back around because at one point it was like too slippery to get up. We'll be back in the summer. But so far this is the view you see. Oh my gosh, there's a big buff. I think we were gonna end up up there. I feel so disappointed, but you know, there's always the next time. And I have the next best thing. There's a nice view right here. I'll show you. All right, it's the next day and we're on a different hike. It's called Merlin Lake Loop. Why oh, that's creepy. I could live in there. And it's not as, well, still going uphill, but it's not as intense as um, yesterday's with the snow and everything. It's only, I think, 130 elevation compared to 1,000 yesterday. We got some stairs. We came from like down there, and you can see the orange markings where we have to go, and it's all right there. And you can go climbing here as well. One of our roommates probably climbed this. You can see the chains up there. It's gonna be a pain in the ass to go back down there so steep. I already pulled off the jackets and I tied it around my waist. Again, I climbed down. Last time this happened, I kind of fell over. I don't think you even need it. What you gonna do without it? Yeah, I don't Pass it over? Toss that. Okay, you go. Without it, then. Oh, you see a better view right here. Yeah, okay. Got you. <laughs> You're cheating. I think we're a bit off trail, but <laughs> look at that. Look how pretty that is. Bye, view. We're gonna go rock climbing now. You wanna go first? Lead the way.
You're gonna try to walk on that rock. I think it's much better if you go through this route. route. What? That route. You're gonna try to walk on that. That was the end viewpoint, but that was, there's actually more. And now this is the viewpoint. And there's a spot down there too, but I don't think I want to go down that far, am I? So this is the actual view, the unobstructed view that I was looking for. Oh, it's gotta be a mission to get all the way down there again. No one didn't come with me, so I hope he's staying put and he's not looking for me. Alright, time to go back and get some food. So we're trying to figure out the way back, and this is supposed to be a loop, so we should loop back. We're taking a different direction back, but it should loop back. And this is also a really nice unobstructed view. <laughs> You're like killing yourself to almost get an unobstructed view when there's like an easy one like right here. There's people climbing the walls right now, so cool. So we just finished the loop and the endpoint loop is much shorter than the loop we took. So if you look on Google map, we walked all along here like a C and then the loop, it just went right across. So we could have just went right across instead of walking the whole damn thing. So yeah, if you're ever hiking um, a Merle loop, just to go backwards. <laughs> Guys, remember this spot? We drove an extra 10 minutes just to come and eat here because else we wouldn't have got food until we went back home and that's like an hour drive so might as well just drive up 10 minutes and the food is amazing here so we're actually going to try to see if there's uber eats because i get 40 percent off so it's like a discount of food so why not why not use it and pick it up and we got our chimichangas Yum. we got some chicken we got exactly the same as what we got last time so excited to eat it <laughs> 